Hey guys and welcome back to Yak Wax Lips. My name is Michael, your point and click adventurer, and this is episode 17 of Let's Play Broker Sword 2 The Smoking Mirror. Perhaps the final episode. Let's see how we go. In the previous episode, George got the Jaguar Stone, but he, he got he, he's basically gonna be sacrificed on top of this pyramid, so we have to go and save him. So we've got this loaded up, but I think we need to fuel this engine somehow, and I don't know how. I'm gonna stick a a stick on there? No. Right, I'm just gonna have a quick look around. There's a button. A lever. Oh, fuel cap. We didn't have that last time. What do you mean no? Just no. No, there, fuel cap. No. The cap was attached to the lift engine by a chain. Right, okay. Can we stick that in the fuel cap? No. Can I just not open the fuel cap? Right, anything else? Generator, fuel, tor. I feel like we need to set this on fire. I could think of no reason why I would want to pull a heavy torch from the ground. Uh, okay. I'm presuming. Can we? Can we just go straight up? I'm presuming we need to. Let's click on the elevator and see what see what Titi, Titi Poco says. Anything? No. It needs fuel. That's what there it needs. There was nothing I wanted to ask him. Hmm. Maybe I put the f cylinder on the fuel? No. Is that just like it a tube? It was a small screw fit cylindrical housing. A small screw fit cylindrical housing. Maybe use that on the fuel line. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're filling it up. That's what I thought. It's just doing it in a really finic fin finic finickety way. That's what I'm going to call it anyway. Right. We're going to put it in the engine. Now we have a working elevator. I guess we could push the button the motor spluttered into life awesome right let's talk to Titi Poco about working this elevator Titi Poco when I tell you I want you to copy what I am doing copy I hope I don't get shot here because I feel like we're just going to go up there and we're not ready. Okay. Copy. Confidence. Here we go. George, I realized those bastards were going to sacrifice George to Tezcatlipoca over my dead body. Thankfully, George was the only one to notice me. Where are they? The eclipse is about to happen. Patience. Your mother will be here soon and Karzak will be close behind. Just keep the Yankee covered and leave the worrying to others. Yeah, Raoul. The maniacs were going to sacrifice George. Shut up, Stobart. Just shut up. Calm down. He's no threat. Hey, Raoul. Why don't you do us both a favor and shoot Pablo? You're very funny, Stobart. I haven't forgotten Marseille. When Karzak cuts your heart out, I'll be the one laughing. I'll bet I'm not the only one due for the chop around here either. Hey, Raoul? I'm warning you. <laughs> Raoul was a bundle of raw nerves. I hoped Georges wouldn't push him too far. All right. Okay, what we've got to do here? Boxes, ammunition belt. Take it. I'm assuming we have to throw that on a fire. Um, where is it? Where is it? Can we throw that on the fire? Incense pot? I couldn't get the belt into the flames without Pablo seeing me. Okay. Um, 
The crates and drums were sealed and I had no way of getting into them. Um, what have we, anything we've got here that we could use? Mm, I kind of feel... Chocolate bar? You want a chocolate bar, Pablo? If Pablo had seen me, he'd have killed me. It was as simple as that. Okay. Can we... I couldn't get near the pot, pot unseen. Hmm, okay. What about down here? Steps. Can we creep down the steps? Um, there were a few sealed crates and drums. None of them looked like they might be useful. Okay, so we've got a gun belt. I, I'm sure we've got to put it on the incense pot. But maybe we... Maybe we have to go back down again and use the bullets... Like, with something else. Um... Sacrificial slab, like I can't click on George. Karzak and his pet vermin had got George tied to the sacrificial table. I had to come up with a plan or he was as good as dead. Okay, all right, I'm gonna go back down. I feel like, I need, I feel like I've got a load of bullets that need to be fired. All right, let's give that to Tipo, maybe he can do it. He wouldn't have wanted it. Alright, okay. Um, maybe I... Put a f no. Put that in the... I'm trying to think. Maybe make them even more... Fuel-y. That's a word. I'm going to claim it anyway. Oh, I'm taking it now. Ah, okay. So maybe we use that in the fuel. No, it doesn't work like that, does it? No, do oh. Nico. Oh, let's just take the torch. What are we going to do with the torch? Now what? Um. Wait, right, I can't use anything with it. Guard? I didn't want to push my luck by talking with the guards again. Okay, but I can pick that up now. That's interesting. Maybe I can use that with the generator. No, nope, doesn't want to doesn't work. Maybe I can use that with the elevator. Can I go that way? No, he doesn't want to do it. Don't you dare go up that elevator, Nico. Right click on the there torch. There was an unlit torch by the base of the steps. Okay, we can do this. We can do this. We can do whatever it is we need. Let's give that to Titipoco. Yes. Something's happening. I don't know what, but Did something. You, do you still have that lighter gun you pulled on me so amusingly? Fantastic. Now we throw the bullets in there. What's going on over there? Do you need help, my pretty? Nothing's wrong. I dropped uh, a cigarette butt. Everything is under control. I'll have the fire out in a minute or two. Right, let's get this in the fire. What's that? What's happening? Trouble. Give it up. The pyramid's surrounded. I'll find out what the trouble is. Watch Stubber doesn't pull any tricks. If he does, shoot him in the head, not through the heart. Why does it matter? He'll be dead either way. His heart belongs to Tezcatlipoca. That's not true. We just had <laughs> dinner a couple of times. Smooth. Oh, we're up. Right, let's... Mm -hmm. Do we have anything? Can we stab him? That wouldn't work. I feel like... I... Oh, it's just... Okay, let's just talk to him. I guess that was it. Drop the gun or I'll shoot! Please, don't hurt me! 
Don't worry yourself, my finger isn't loaded. Nico, what are you doing here? Firstly, I'm going to set George free, and then screw up Karzak's scheme. No, I can't let you do that. Karzak has promised me power. Raoul, wake up. The only thing Karzak has on offer is death. You may want to ask Oubie, except you can't. Karzak murdered him. You're lying. Oubie is in Europe. Sure he's in Europe. In London, on a mortuary slab with two bullet holes in him. But Karzak promised. When he frees Tezcatlipoca, we'll all be granted great power. Listen to her, Raoul. Karzak's insane. I, I, I don't know. I, I need to think. You've let your mother do your thinking for you up to now. You need to think for yourself. Your mother and Karzak think alike. There's only one expendable member of the plan left, and that's you. Mother would never betray me. Oh, I'm tired of trying to reason with you, Raoul. Titipoco. Watch this man, and if he makes a move, shoot him with your gun. All right, let's cut him free. I'm presuming that's what we do. Maybe we can stab him. Hold still, George. I don't want to sacrifice <laughs> you by accident. An accidental sacrificial George. You have no idea how glad I am to see you. They were going to cut your heart out. I think I can guess. We can save the happy reunions for later. We've got to move. Come on. Safe. This is a dead end. We're toast. I know, Tidipoko. I'm not too happy here either. He knows this is Tezcatlipoca's pyramid. The house of the enemy. Well, we can't stay here like rats in a trap. And we can't go out the way we came in. It would be suicide. I'll have a look round. Maybe there's another way out. In the meantime... Take this. It's the Coyote Stone. It might bring you luck, I hope. You managed to recover the stones from the village? Then we might have a chance after all. Incidentally, what would Titipoco have done if Graciento had moved? Titipoco? Nothing. He's given up violence. <laughs> right, I feel... Oh, Lever. I feel like this is the end game. Lever, Lever. Maybe... Both of them at the same time. Oof. The lever was very difficult to move and appeared to do nothing anyway. Okay. Let's ask George to do the other one for me, please. George? Yeah? Lever, please. That lever didn't seem to do anything. Know what I say? Nil desperandum. George, sometimes I could just punch you. <laughs> me too, Nico, me too. <clears throat> Heave! Still no good. <laughs> Heave! Right, come on, George, help me out. No? George? Yeah? Pull the George, lever. I can only pull one lever at a time, and I think we need to pull both together. Okay, I'm up for that. <laughs> Ah, I was expecting the door to open. <laughs> Raoul, there's something suspicious. Go this sacrifice. Where is it? Nico was here with Titi Poco. They set him free. I couldn't stop them. You idiot. I should have strangled you at birth. Titipoco's gone soft. He wouldn't have hurt you. I know that. The darkness of this honey is almost upon us and we have no sacrifice to appease Tezcatlipoca. Have you any idea what your incompetence will cost us? I think so. And I'm glad. What? The Mayans weren't fools. 
Tess Cutley Poker should stay exactly where they put him. Finally got some backbone from somewhere, huh? Shame it's so late in the day. I'd rather die than see you and Karzak with that devil's power. Fine, we're still a sacrifice short. See, the eclipse begins. Pablo, kill him! This Cutley Poker can feed upon his yellow heart. Nico was right all along, but it's still not too late. Come on then, Pablo. Let's see who sacrifices who. <coughs> Oof. What place is this? I was in some sort of strange room. Tiles and dials. The priests who designed this place must have known how to use them. I was going to have to figure it out for myself if I ever wanted to get out of here. Oh, blimey. There's a whole puzzle thing going on here. I honestly thought, that's it, we're at the top of the pyramid, we're done. But now after looking at this, I vaguely remember this scene. We have to do. All oh, right, okay. So we need, oh God. Right, so that's, we need to make these four tiles, I guess. Can we click on that? The tile didn't move at all. There's an Easter egg here as well, isn't it, where Nico uh, flashes herself. The tile herself. didn't move at all. But um, maybe in the maybe in the extra episode, I'll do it at the end. We'll see if we can do that one. Um, can I push it? The tile didn't want to move. Okay, so I guess we've got to make this, which is. Let's have a look on here. Combination of... Lord, I don't know. I just don't know. Like that one. That's what that one is. The tile moved slightly. Moved slightly because that's... that. That's... No, that's not that at all. Ugh. Because that's that. That and that equals that. And we're trying to make that so what else is that that is that one isn't it so we need to make that one which is um how do i the do room this? was dominated by an enormous device decorated with the usual mayan motifs it held two great discs each covered in glyphs can we move them Okay, we can move them, excellent. So, which one, um, which one are we making? Th this, so it's kind of like a bluey bottoms with a big fat top things. Guess that's this. Where are you going? No, wrong way. Ah, oh, Nico, this can take a while. I reckon we might have to, um, We'll have to go into the next episode. We'll see. We'll see how long this takes. It's time consuming, that's the thing. I know what I'm doing. So we've got to get this one. Wonderful. Now we move over here. And we push this one. I think. Yeah, which means we can probably push this one. The dial moved inwards and clicked home. Okay, all right. So what else have we got here then? We need this one, which is like a flower and a crown, I guess. So where's the flower? There's the flower. Come on, we can do it. Right, whilst I'm here, I might as well um, say that even if it's not the next episode, even if it's not the last episode, um, it might be, who knows. Um, next up will be Broken Sword 2.5, not Broken Sword 3. So I'm going to do the fan game, which I've never done before. And I kind of only vaguely knew of its existence recently, fairly recently. I'll say that a couple of years ago, maybe. So it's going to be fun. I think it's set... Oh between this game and the next game number two and three since it's called 2.5 because that's how maths work all right push that one push that 
Fish, lovely. What else do we have here? This one? I think it's that one, isn't it? So, squirrely toothpaste. And what's that? It's like a green cave. Where's the squirrely toothpaste? Squirrely toothpaste up there. And the green cave is there. We can do it. We can do this in this episode. We've got you. Right, if I pull it here, then it's going to pull that way, isn't it? I wonder where George and, and Titi Poco's gone as well. Right, we've just done this. Stop, stop, Nico, stop. Done. Oh no, is that just... What's that done? Oh, it just popped out that one. Okay, next one, bottom left. We can do it, we can do it. It's that one, which is sausage and a cross. Where's the cross? Right, the cross is there. Plenty of time, plenty of time. I must say it's absolutely freezing in this room right now. It has, it has turned, the weather has turned. But I'm, um, I'm gonna play it regardless. Okay, lovely. That's that one. That's it, push. And then we need... Uh, what is it? Three potatoes on top of a, a big potato with hair. So here's the three potatoes. On top of a blonde... a blonde potato. the tile. <coughs> Fabulous. And then the last one kind of looks like a blue little demon lying in bed eating some crisps. So that is this one which is a bed and some crisps. So that is this one, is that right? That looks kind of like it, I guess. Yes, that's right. Fabulous. And then we've just got one more to do. that tile right and the other one is uh, this one this one here which are th like three little elf shoes which is these and I'm just going to call it splodge because I mean it looks like a splodge And, uh, coming back to the, the return to Monkey Island post thing that I mentioned the other day, uh, the majority of you said that you'd like to see me play all the way through to Broken Sword 5 until I play Return to Monkey Island. And uh, I'm very glad because that was my thinking as well. So what was the other one? The splodge. Of course it was a splodge. So you've got another three games until Return to Monkey Island. At least another three games. Where's the, spl where's the splodge? Is that it? But I, I guess I guess that's it. Doesn't look as splodgy as the other one. One more on the mass. Right, I reckon that's it. Yeah, that's it, isn't it? Push the tile. This is it. This is is this is this the end of the end? Who knows? Let's just go on. Let's just crack on. Yes. <laughs> Et voilà. Et voilà. George once told me that there's an act to finding secret doors. I think I'm beginning to get the hang of it. All right, tedious, but we got there in the end. Revealed exit.
So I thought, this is it, you know? This is true love. Anyway, I have to leave for a few weeks, and when I come back, what do I find? Ugh. Damn right. And with who? Labano, that creep. Mm. Huh? Yeah, that's exactly what I thought. I thought this was the end. It's not the end. Shall I carry on? Shall I not carry on? I kind of feel like if I carry on, this episode could go to 35 minutes. But if I don't, the next one might be three minutes. Oh, heck. Looks like another dead end, Titty Poco. Any ideas? Any ideas? Where's he going? I was hoping for something a little more constructive. Never mind, I'll have a look around. Right, let's take this torch. I feel like I've gone on too much. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to rally on through to the end. Shall I? Shall I not? Hmm. You know what? You're going to get another episode. I'm going to leave it there with George holding a torch because I have no idea if this is right at the end or whether there's another 20 minutes afterwards. It is like the end, but, you know, 20-something 20, 20 minutes already. Um, yeah, I've, I've really enjoyed myself today. And thankfully, he didn't die. Good old George. Um, but yeah, I guess I'll just leave it there. Please leave a like. really appreciate it. The next episode will absolutely be the last episode. And like I say, it will only be five minutes long. But you get another episode anyway. Uh, yeah, please leave a like. really appreciate it. Uh, until next time, have a wonderful morning, afternoon or evening. Whatever it is you are doing right now. And take care.